Hi everybody, it's Crystal. Welcome to my channel, Bag of Day Crochet, where we talk about everything eh, crochet and yarn related. So why don't we go ahead and begin? I have some yarn to show you. Um, I do have a tutorial for that shawl back there. You can't really see it because it's so on a shelf. Um, it's my newest shawl at the making of the video, which is 10 17 2022. The Speed of Light Shawl. I'll put a link below in the description box. All right, so today I'm going to show you some yarn that I purchased from Little Knits. Now, if you're not familiar with Little Knits, Little Knits is my favorite yarn company, small yarn company, I'll say that, um, within the, the United States. They sell uh, like higher end yarns at extremely good deals. I don't know if maybe it's close out yarns, close out colors, overstock, whatever it is. I don't care because it's good deals. The best deals that I have ever found. So why don't we check it out? I'm super excited. I love Little Knits a lot. You sh I highly recommend you check them out. Okay, let's see what we got. Now, if you go to their website, it will tell you how much they originally were and then how much uh, you're saving. A lot of the times it's like 30 to 80%, depending on what yarn it is. So, oh, I'm excited. All right, so we'll just start off with what's on top. Okay, this is a uh, Aracuna yarn. I probably never say that right, but I love, love this yarn. It is a very, very nice brand of yarn. I mean, in my eyes, I love it. I don't think I've ever purchased a yarn from Aracuna that I did not like. This was one that I've never had before, so I'm going to show you. So, Aracuna, probably ain't saying it right, but there we go. That's how I always say it, though. This is called um, Yumbrel. Yumbrel DK. DK stands for double knit, which is a lightweight number three. Hand painted cotton. So it's hand dyed cotton. It feels really, really nice. I, I It feels good. So we, let's go ahead and read it. So it is the lightweight three, a DK. It's 100% combed cotton. Um, it says that you... Um, can machine wash, but they recommend laying flat to dry. Understandable since it being cotton and stuff. Um, what else can I tell you about it? Why don't we check out the yardage? 218 yards or 200 meters, 3.52 ounces or 100 grams. Oh, it's so pretty. All right, so this is what it looks like. I thought this one was so gorgeous. Uh, blue and brown together is absolutely stunning. It feels really nice. It smells really clean. <laughs> I'm a yarn smeller. I'll show you their DK here. So there's their lightweight three. That's about spot on for a three weight. It's a nice three weight, you know. I can manage that one. Isn't that color pretty? <laughs> it's really pretty. So the color is called uh, La La Lista. I think that's how you say it. Number sixteen. So you these are normally. Normally, they're $15.50 a hank, um, but the, Little Knits has them for $6.95 a hank. But if you buy, you at Little Knits, you can buy per, per ball, or you can, sometimes they have them in packs. Well, they did happen to have this yarn in packs, and you can get it a little bit cheaper um, if you buy it by the pack. So the pack um, of, it's a pack of five, which would normally be $77.50. I got for 29 99 what a deal from little knits so i got five of those what a deal that's nice but i did get more than one color um this one is a little bit somewhat well i guess it's not it's got uh it's the same yarn all the same specs just a different color oh that's pretty that's more of a tan i guess the blues now that don't even look the same at all does it not at all. Not at all. That's beautiful. It's soft. Very garment worthy. I mean, you could definitely make a garment out of it. Um, the color of this one is called Rio 
Serrano, 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 number 14. So very pretty. I got a five pack for $29.99 originally. $77.50. How can you beat that? You can't. You can't beat it. Got another one. I mean, they had a lot of pretty colors. Sometimes I have a hard time choosing. This one's beautiful. Look at that one. So that's pink with a bit of brown in it. Not a lot. Not a lot. You can just see hints of brown in it there. Very subtle. That's very beautiful. The color on this one is called Rosa Andina. I love it. It's beautiful. I got a five pack of these, so I got over a thousand yards. So, you know, that's definitely something I can make my daughter with that. Um, and then there's this one, which is called... Terra Inca, Terra Inca, color number 20. It's more of a, here's the pink. It's more of a red, I guess, but it's not really red. It's not as dark as the website shows, but it's still very pretty. It's kind of a mauve, mauve color, I would say. Very, very pretty. I like that one. Okay, I think I got one more color of these, and it's probably my favorite. Yeah, it's my favorite. <laughs> that one. Oh, it's pretty, 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 pretty. That's bag of day colors. I got to make something out of that. It's beautiful. The color of this one is called, I can't pronounce it, but it's number 38. Very, very pretty. I love that one. So I like them all, but if I had to pick a favorite out of the colors, it's going to be these two. Number eight. Or number 38, number 16. Both are very beautiful, but all are very, very beautiful. Like I said, at 30 bucks, normally 77. What a deal. What a deal. All right, uh, let's see what else I have here. So I got some um, Queensland yarn. I like Queensland. I've actually had this before, but. I don't have it anymore until now. So the Queensland, let me look it up here. I'm just going to tell you how much it is from them, from their site. I can get it uh, brought up here. Okay. The Queensland is $22.50 for five tanks. It's the Queensland Collection Brisbane. Pure Australian Superwash Wool. Mm. that's a tie for the hank in case you wondered it's not messed up you cut that whenever you kick it up okay so this is 100 percent wool but it's not it's not an itchy wool it's nice i would make a garment out of it um now they classify this as a bulky number five that wouldn't be my classification i do a full weight on that i mean whatever you think though I think that might be misclassified. Well, in my, it, just in my eyes, it looks like it's a little bit thinner than a bulky five. It could be on like a thicker four way, but um, three point five two ounces, one hundred grams, one hundred and forty four yards, or one hundred thirty two meters. I wonder if this would felt. Yeah, I think this would probably felt nicely. This is color one hundred one, so it's just a nice, beautiful tan. And then I had to get this mustard yellow. Remember, these were $22.50 for five hanks. Oh, that's pretty. Very pretty. Color number 104. Yeah, I definitely wouldn't do a bulky file on that. Like an Aaron thicker four weight. Something like that. But whatever you think. It's very pretty, though. And it's soft, you know, like for, for it being a wool and not a super wash wool or anything, it's quite scarfable. I would make a scarf out of it like that so those are very beautiful i love those but like i said i've had them before and i knew that i would like them okay let's see what else we got here i got some this is ella ray i like ella ray too ella ray's a very 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 nice yarn
Okay, we got some Ella Ray Cozy a Soft Chunky. <gasps> Look at that brown. Beautiful, beautiful brown. Nice. Now that is definitely a five weight. So, okay, so it is a chunky, which is a five weight. It's machine washable wool, 75 acrylic, 25 wool. All right, bulky number five, machine wash, lay flat, 131 yards, 120 meters, 3.52 ounces, 100 grams. It's very soft. It's very nice. And yeah, I'd give that a bulky five probably. It's a little thicker than the other one, I guess. I guess just the weight is just in the eye of the person crocheting with it. Yeah, but yeah, I'd give that the bulky five classification, I think. it's. So I got this beautiful brown. Of course, I'm going to pick brown. It's color 212. And look what I'm thinking about pairing it with. Oh, beautiful. This one is... Okay. Well, this is just color 212. This is golden oak color 230. Oh, my. Those are beautiful. Look how shiny. You know, they got a bit of a shine on them as well. You can see a little... You can see it on both of them. But you can see a little bit more on that on that uh, pump, dark pumpkin color or rusty. I keep in these, so the fact that I'm rubbing on them is irrelevant because I'm going to make something with them. <laughs> Isn't that pretty? So the uh, Ella Ray Cozy Chunky is $15.99 for five of them. So I got five of the rust and five of the brown. $15.99 for these. $15.99 e these. Not each. That's for all five. What a deal. What a deal. What a deal. Got it in green as well. You know, it would make a pretty cool pumpkin, but I'm not going to do that. The green is called Hunter Green, and it is color number two, 227. Again, five of them for $15.99. <sighs> I love little mitts. If I had any place that I could buy yarn at within the United States, it would be Little Knits. I mean, definitely it would be Little Knits. All right, up next I have some uh, Barraco. Barraco. I don't know how you say it. I always say Barraco. Now, this is a sesame. Now, this can be an expensive, well, not really expensive, but sometimes it can be 15 to 20 dollars a ball depending on where you go um so i was able to get a five pack of them for 36.99 mm -hmm. i said that 36.99 for five and you know a lot of times they can be 15 to 20 dollars a piece but yeah I'm not joking. I mean, it's for reals. It's for reals. It says it right here. Thirty-six. I'm just, I'm just kidding. Thirty-six ninety-nine for five. These look very similar. That's okay. I think it's beautiful. Sesame. It's such a pretty yarn. Oh, look at that. Feels good. Smells clean. It always does. So this is 43% wool, 39 acrylic, 9 cotton, 9 nylon. Color number 7454. 3.5 ounces, 100 grams, 230 yards, 210 meters. So this uh, Barrico is a number 4 weight. Made in Italy. Let's see the care instructions. Machine wash on, on separately, it says, for best results. In a mesh bag, in cold water, on delicate cycle. And then you lay it flat to dry. So, um, if I think I remember the name of this, one might be called Hibiscus. If I, get, I think that's the name. But if not, it's color number 7454. So that is so pretty. So I did get five of those. Not joking. Five of them. What did I say? $36.99. And I'm not joking when I say they can run $15 and $20 a ball normally. They, they really can. 
it's it's no joke i only tell the truth here okay yeah so these are regular 1850 a ball i thought i'd look it up here um but little nits has them it really depends on which color you get um some of them are, are for 1850 down to 829 and some colors are down to 1280 a ball and some of them have five packs and some of them do not the five packs are like i said not joking i'm not joking <laughs> 36.99 so i got this one and then i got one more which is similar but i think i like it a little bit better because i like them both they're very pretty but this one is probably more my colors Ooh, ooh look at that one that's so pretty the color on this one is color number 7448 i don't remember the name of this one i really don't maybe it says it on my sheet maybe it says it oh look here oh yeah this one was the hibiscus i was correct with the one with the purple in it which is very pretty on it by itself and then okay it's a uh, zen garden now this one they didn't have in a five pack i had to buy i had to buy five of them separately um for eight dollars and 29 cents a piece which does not bother me considering they're usually 18 something isn't that one beautiful this is my favorite but i do like them both see they're kind of similar i guess when you pull them up together they're they're not really similar at all are they <laughs> <laughs> I like them both though. All right, so that's the sesame. They have a beautiful brown one as well. I have that one though, but I'm keeping it for something special. Okay. Um, let's see. Okay, and then let me move on here. This was a yarn I've never had by uh, Barico. It's called Barico Pixel. I like getting new yarns I've never seen before. Oh, it's roving style. upside down sorry it feels good it smells like wool soft and it's roving style as you can see the roving is just it's just that one ply there of a roving style yarn now this looks like it's a bit thin um the pixel is 100 percent super wash wool 3.5 ounces, 100 grams, 328 yards, 300 meters. Yeah, it's a lightweight number three. Made in Italy, machine wash on cold on delicate cycle, and you can tumble dry on delicate as well. Nice. So they, this one is color. This one is called coconut. So they're, um, it's a very beautiful color, very much my colors. So they're classifying this as a lightweight three. Now, as with the roving, the nature of the roving is to go from thick to thin. That's just what it does. That is a very lightweight three, though. But I would imagine there, yeah, there are spots that it thickens up. Yeah, because that's just how roving is. A lot of people don't like that about roving, that it goes from thick to thin. Um, sometimes they think that there's something wrong with the yarn. But just remember, that is the nature of the roving. You just roll with it. I love it. Roving is my favorite style of yarn this is very beautiful it's got a wash look to it i like this like i said i've never had it before let me see how much it cost on a rig on the rig the regular basis all right this whole time i'm saying pixie it's pixel pixel barico <laughs> pixel yeah i like it so the pixel um is normally twenty dollars a hank they have some very pretty colors, but I only got this color because it is um, very, it's a lightweight three and it's a very lightweight three, but my gosh, they have some pretty colors in it. So it's normally $20 a hank. Um, Little Knits has it for $10.85 a hank, or you can buy a five pack, which is normally $100 for five for $49.99, so half price you're getting this if you buy the of uh, five pack you're getting them for 10 bucks a hank normally 20 what a deal i like it um 
if it's not too lightweight for me, I would definitely buy it again. They have a beautiful, beautiful blue and brown that I like a lot too. And a yellow with red in it. And a dark blue. Okay. I'll just see how that one does first. All right. I got one more variety of yarn to show you. Just two different colors in it. And I got some Malabrego. I love Malabrego. Malabrego. I always have a top five favorite yarns. And they change every once in a while. Malabrego is my number two um, now I'm not talking big box store yarns. I'm talking yarns that, um, that you can't find at big box stores. You know, the ones that are a little bit more expensive. Um, Malabrego is number two out of my top five favorite yarns. So I got Malabrego. This is their washed. Malabrego washed. Isn't that some pretty yarn? And I always say it, the one thing I can tell, I can always tell it's Malabrego by the way it smells. It smells like vinegar. Now I know that's part of the dyeing process and it's not an off-putting smell. It's actually, I've come to love that smell because when I smell the yarn and it's, it has a very distinctive, um, not strong, but a vinegar smell, I know it's Malabrego and I love Malabrego. So it's, it's, I, I actually love the smell of it. So the washed right here. That's what this one is. It is a number four weight, 210 yards, 192 meters, 100 grams. Super wash, 100% super wash merino. Here is the color number 862 on this one. Now, uh, the Malabrego at um, Little Knits is... It runs in line with a lot of other Malabregos um, as far as price goes, but they did have a sale that they had it for 25% off. So that was a good deal. So it's $15.40 a hank, but they had that 25% off of all their Malabregos. So whatever that was, uh, but normally it's $15.40. Which isn't bad. Malabrego usually runs between, I've seen it, 15 to $20 a hank, just depending on which variety you get, I guess. But anyways, I got this one. It's a roping style, as you can see. That is gorgeous. I love that one. Mm -hmm. I got mm, three of those colors. Here they are. Ooh. And then I got three of this one. This is the same, washed. This one is called, this one, 880. Very, very beautiful. You can see why it's called washed. It's got that washed look to it. A lot of these they, they will make um, in solid, not, not with the washed look, but just regular. And then I got this color. This is also the washed. Oh, I like that one. So I got three of them, except for this one. They only had two left, so I was only able to get two. But that's an okay because um, one of these will make me a hat, and that is normally what I, that's probably what I'll do with it. Um, so, and then three of them will make me a hat and a scarf. So if I wanted to do that, that's what I will do with those. But anyways, that is my little knit haul favorite yarn i don't know i like i like them, them all it's hard to choose um this uh sesame and this color right here is so beautiful i love that one i love the ella ray oh my gosh but i've had it before but i've always given it away but i'm keeping these these two for certain i love the aracuna and the pixel both very beautiful this one might be a little bit too lightweight for me to use but i think if I had to choose, it's always going to be Malibu. It's going to be my favorite. But I love it all. I do. It's all very, very beautiful. And again, I highly recommend Little Knits. They're such a wonderful, wonderful store. Extremely nice people. You know, if you ever have any questions, they always answer them. And um, yeah, it's my favorite place. Small business in the U.S. to shop at. So you get killer deals, killer prices, excellent customer service, and they got a large variety of yarn to choose from. So thank you everybody for watching, and I'll see you on my next video, whatever that might be. Bye guys.